People have been asking me about my thoughts on Kraken for Canadians and so in this video I'm going to quickly talk about my thoughts on them and why I personally don't think they're a good option for Canadians specifically and I'll give some better alternatives to them. So the first issue that I have with Kraken is funding one's account. Now there are two ways that you can do this. You could do it via crypto and the other would be with Canadian dollars. Now to fund Kraken directly with Canadian dollars their fee is 0.5%. Upon funding your account you would then need to trade your Canadian dollars for USD which would cost 0.2%. Now you could certainly leave your Canadian dollars as they are but the only coins that they have trade pairs against are Bitcoin, Ethereum and XRP. Now I assume that in most cases you would be converting your Canadian dollars for US dollars as coins are traded against the US dollar. This means that your initial cost just to fund your account is 0.7% when you add up all of the fees. If you decide to fund your account with USDC instead, you still kind of run into the same issue. Kraken's trade pairs are against USD, not USDC, and so you would pretty much need to sell your USDC for USD, which means that you're going to incur this 0.2% trade fee. So pretty much even before you begin to trade, you've already incurred a fee of roughly 0.7%. Now, the second reason why I don't like them is because of their trade trade fees. Kraken's trade fees are 0.16% for makers and 0.26% for takers, which are a bit on the expensive side compared to what their competitors offer. I would say that their direct competitors for Canadians would be BitGet and Crypto.com Exchange. BitGet's base trade fees are 0.1% for both makers and takers. This can be even lower by using my signup link, which will save you 20%. If you're interested in that, I'll leave that in the video description. By saving 20% on your trade fees, that effectively cuts the trade fees by practically half of Kraken's. As for Crypto.com Exchange, their base trade fees are 0.075% for both makers and takers. Now the last reason is with withdrawals because at the end of the day it's how much you actually take home after fees. So when it comes to cashing out there are a couple of different options. One would be via e-transfer while the other would be with crypto. With e-transfer the withdrawal fee is a flat $10. But mind you you would first need to sell your USD for Canadian dollars which means that you would incur that 0.2% trade fee. The other option would be to send out your coin to then cash out with a Canadian crypto platform. In that case my guess is that you would want to buy a coin that's cheap and quick to send off like XLM. In that case, you'd incur the 0.26% trade fee. With all that said, I personally don't think Kraken is great for Canadians when you add up all of the fees and inconveniences to trade on them. This is especially true when you look at their competitors like BitGet and Crypto.com Exchange. BitGet offers more and charges less. Crypto.com Exchange is more convenient to trade on and charges less in fees. Hope you learned something and thanks for watching.